took my kids to school. Well, actually, I took them to the bus stop. I don't take them to school anymore. I've been relieved of that duty. So there's not gonna be as much driving around and talking on the video while I'm driving. But I won't be driving downtown for my kids, but possibly will be for my mother. This is the point of this video, I have a prayer request. I, uh, I ask that you would pray very earnestly that we would find a place for my mom. She's in a place now where they haven't treated her well, to be honest. Everybody's caring, but it's not really a facility that's designed for the type of ailment that she has. She's got Alzheimer's. And just the other day, she got upset. They had to restrain her and give her a shot of a medicine that they give to psycho patients, actually. And my mom is not psycho. My mom is very loving and caring. And she's prone to get upset, but aren't we all? And nobody who gets upset deserves to be restrained and given a very highly, it's not even sedative, it's, it's a mental kind of medicine that she doesn't deserve. And that's the way, unfortunately, the world treats people anymore. It's like, we don't have time for this. We, we can't help you. We're just going to fill you foot of, full of chemicals and, and, uh, and just not deal with you. We're going to let you be like these poor zombie other old women that are sitting around in this hall that we've medicated enough to where they now just sit around and drool on themselves. Last night I went and read to my mom the scriptures. While I was doing so, in between she just babbled complete nonsense. It, it, was, it was like choppy nonsense. I mean, she doesn't make sense anyway, but it was worse than I'd ever seen. I don't know what they give her yesterday. But once again, I ask that you would pray very earnestly for my dear mother. Her name is Charlotte. But when I came back from dropping my kids off the bus stop, it was before the sun had actually risen. And I saw a beautiful cloud with golden lining. Forget the silver. God showed me a golden lining. It gave me great hope for this day. And I thank you for your prayers.